what's happening is kira welcome back to my channel as you guys see by the title today you already know what i'm going to be doing i'm going to be making a wig i'm going to be doing this the easiest way the fastest way so if you guys want to see me make this wig then keep watching the hair I'm using today is from olivehair.com. Uh, what I'm using a 4x4 lace closure is a 14 inch and I'm also using a 18 inch, a 20 inch and a 22 inch in the bundles. So the first thing I'm going to do is bleach my knots. If you guys want your lace to blend, you got to bleach them knots, you know. That's going to help it blend more. So I'm going to take my wig cap and I'm going to apply it on my mannequin head. I did have a trash bag underneath it, but I'm going to remove it because it was just getting irritating and I just moved the bag out the way. Then I'm going to just pin down my wig cap to keep it stable so it won't be moving everywhere, you know, how that stuff go. After 15 minutes, go wash out your lace. So now I'm going to take my lace closure and I'm going to pin it like an inch over my cap. I did let my lace closure dry overnight, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to comb the hairs into like two ponytails to keep them hairs out of my way. So now I'm going to take my needle and thread and we're going to sew down this lace closure. So now I'm going to take my longest bundle and I'm going to start gluing from side to side on the wig cap.
closure it.
for a side park look so i'm going to park me a little side park but i know me i'm going to repark it again when i put the wig on my head 